What's up everybody? Well, today I got another gameplay video for you guys. Uh, it's gonna be Battlefield 21, 2042. Almost called it Battlefield 2142. That's a whole nother old school mod, basically. Anyway, they actually just came out with a driver update before, right before I uh, did the other two videos for uh, 4K. Uh, I think it was like something like 18% uplift on this particular GPU, so that's pretty sweet. So we should see similar performance to ultra wide, a couple frames less. So, I'm willing to bet this laptop can play up to high no problem getting 60 FPS, we'll see. But, it's probably going to do the same thing as Ultra Wide. We'll probably be a little under 60 at Ultra, and ray tracing is probably going to make it terrible, unplayable. But, let's find out. So, let's get into it. Alright, starting out at 4K here with low settings. Just going to very quickly cruise through here. They have control of Sector Echo. Okay, I guess now we can get into gameplay. All right, jumping into some 4K low settings. Low is weird. Some stuff looks all right, but a lot of stuff you can be like, okay, yeah, I, I can tell this is on low. But at least we're getting all right frames, though, if we're already getting this close to, you know, if we're getting to 61, 60, yeah, we just dropped under 59, then yeah, we're probably not going to do so hot on the higher settings, but hey, who cares? Still, we're going to test it out so you guys can see how it runs. Closer. Most sectors are now under our control. Sector Echo fully secure. Hmm, some barriers and some palm tree. All right, what do we got going on down here? Alright, our teammate in that hovercraft is getting messed up by something from the air. Alright, let's move on to some camera gameplay, shall we? Okay. 4K low settings. Camera recorded now, and we are already dropping under 60, so I would probably not recommend playing a competitive game like this at 4K. Unless you really don't care and you just want to play and have fun. What? Well, you don't care about your frame rate, because I don't think I'd be able to play very good at 50 frames a second. And it even drops down in the 40s every once in a while. That looks like an enemy. All right, got that guy. Ah, missed out. And I really, really, really want to get this 
guy. If he's even still there. Yeah. Instead, I got sniped. Well, whatever. It was time to stop anyway. All right. Medium settings at 4K now. One of our objectives has been attacked. All right. As we can see, everything is on medium. So now let's get into the gameplay. All right. Into some medium 4K now. Well, definitely some action over here. Let's go see what's going on. Had a hit marker on him at least. They've occupied Sector Charlie. Another hit marker. That's annoying. Stay back. All right, where shall we go? Shall we go over here? Yes. Alright, time to move on to camera. Alright, medium camera recorded gameplay now. I almost killed that one guy from really far away and then someone else sniped me, that was lame. Now there's somebody going up there to snipe. Wow. No idea how the heck he did that with an Xbox controller. That's literally impossible. But okay. They're literally trying to say someone with a dinky little controller can actually shoot better than me. I guess I am shooting on the ground now, so... Guess I gotta give the little noob a little handicap. My guess is they probably have some noob auto-aim crap, like most console games have. Sad. But let's move on. Alright, now we're going to do high settings. Alright. I'd say that's good enough. Let's get into the gameplay. Alright. Hi now. 
we have dropped very, very far below 60 at this point. It does look a lot better now, though. But I'm not very good at playing first person shooters at under 60, but that's just me. Maybe other people could play this, no problem. It also doesn't help I'm sitting on the floor, but with a camera sitting directly in my line of vision. Oh, got shot in the back. Go deploy over B1 here. Head over to B2. All right, that's a bunch of teammates. All right, let's cruise on down and see what's up. seeing the people that were killing them all, but they're obviously there somewhere. Let's move on to camera. All right. Hi, camera recorded gameplay now, and it is not doing so good. There's a tank over there. Let's cruise on over here real quick. Get a better look at what's going on from farther distance. It's really not easy to play down here. Ah, cool, a tornado. I'm pretty sure I could never, ever, ever get this close to a tornado, but alrighty. 
I would have been sucked up away. But let's move on and see what ray tracing does. I dread to see this. All right, now ultra settings. Go through this very quickly. And all right, now let's get on to the gameplay. Okay, now we're up to ultra settings at 4K. Now we have a tornado. Now, truthfully speaking, I think I would have been sucked into that thing a long time ago. But I'm not exactly a meteorologist, so who knows? They captured Sector Bravo. Oh no, not Bravo. Both sectors are now under our control. Ooh, an EMP blast or something there for a second. All my stuff went away. Now, let's try to get across here real quick then. I don't like crossing big open things, I'm a sniper. That's just asking to get shot. Because that's exactly what I would shoot at people at if I were a sniper, which I am. Or at least I'm trying to be. I always used to be really good with the AWP back in Counter-Strike days. This game is quite a bit different than Counter-Strike, let me tell you. Oh, I see them over to my right. Alright, there we go, we got somebody. I can't really hit him though, because this tree. I'm excited to try anyway, Enemy just for fun. Control. Let's reload. And move on to camera. Alright. Ultra gameplay now. FPS department now. That's a teammate. We don't want to shoot him. Ah. It's not easy to aim really far away with a sniper rifle. You have to lead and all sorts of stuff. But if it was easy, everyone would do it. Alright, let's not go get run over by a tank. I mean, I start probably will be killed by the tank, but... I have no idea how these losers are doing that. There's literally no way you can accurately aim with a controller better than I can with a mouse even sitting on the ground. It's just not going to happen. And it's really starting to just get really, really annoying. Oh well. Once I'm back on my main computer, I'll go on and just absolutely roast console gamers and teach them that they shouldn't be playing competitive games on consoles. Alright, let's move on. Alright, last up is 
everything maxed out like it was before, but we're adding ray traced ambient occlusion, which is probably going to make us get single digit FPS. Well, let's go find out, shall we? And all right. Oh yeah, 3 FPS. We definitely are getting single and double digit FPS. This is not a ray traced GPU. I hit somebody though. I actually hit someone. I killed someone! Hell yeah! With these horrible FPS, I killed someone. I don't even care that I died. That is impressive. Only thing it would have made more impressive if I killed them while I was getting FPS like that. Let's go over here to E1. It looks like it's having some trouble. I'm probably going to get steamrolled, but let's just see what's going on. Alright, so we got a big old armored vehicle over there, just chilling. I think he just saw me. Wait for him to get distracted. Now let's try really hard and just cruise over here and not get blown up by him. I think I just saw an enemy running in there. Try to go in there and kill him, but I'm probably gonna die, but who cares? Let's pull out my pistol too, just in case. Seeing as the close quarters combat is not usually that best for the sniper rifles. I mean I'm pretty good at quick scoping, but not when I'm getting 30 FPS. <laughs> oh. Seems as though it is victory. Cool. Let's move on. All right. Now it's time to do camera recorded gameplay. And uh, yeah, as you guys can tell, uh, ray tracing and 4K does not mix. Now this should be a challenge. If I can actually hit somebody. Getting like seven FPS. Now that would be a challenge. All right, hey, we're starting to get at least double digit FPS now. That's that's an improvement. Nope, oh, nope, nope. We're falling. We're falling again, guys. We're a dropping. She can't handle any more, Scotty. Oh man. Chop City. Oh, oh teammate. But all right, this is absolutely awful, so I'm kind of glad that this is over. I don't even care. Good. You did me a favor, man. This was awful. I'm just going to put myself out of the misery. There we go. But all right, let's, uh, let's wrap this video up now, shall we? Well, all right. That just about will wrap it up for this video. It uh, does not seem to handle 4K that well. Even high was dropping below 60. So unless you want, if you want to do 4K, medium is about your best bet. I think we stayed above 60 pretty much all the time. A couple jumps down to like 58 or something, 54, something like that. But beyond that, 
pretty good, but high, ultra, and ray tracing especially. Do not play this game ray tracing at all on any other resolutions. It just turns it into a stutter fest. Anyway, though, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And until the next one, peace out, guys.